Hi there, and thank you for joining me for another Big Sky Mystery Monday. This is video number four that I've done for today, just this video. The reason why is that the first video that I shot for Big Sky Mystery Monday, I did all in one shot, and after going through it, I said the word, um, 41 times in less than six minutes. And y'all deserve better than that, so I am redoing the videos until I am doing it less than five times in the video accidentally. Not saying that word on purpose, just to illustrate the point. So anyway, moving on, here's the update. I am switching to a different format on Big Sky Mystery Monday, and it's going to happen every other Monday, starting with not this Monday, but the Monday following. So two weeks from this Monday, you'll get a new video. The reason for this is that I am switching the format. <sighs> Sorry, gotta breathe. And the format that I'm gonna switch to is an educate and update format. And what that means is that I am going to be doing educational material every other Monday and so the first topic that I'm going to be doing it under is actually paranormal, which makes total sense seeing how this is what the channel is about a lot of the time. And the reason why I'm doing paranormal first is because a lot of the things that I talk about fall under the category of paranormal. Whether we're talking Bigfoot, whether we're talking the Flathead Lake Monster, Skinwalkers, all of those are considered paranormal by the scientific community or uh, um, I'm sure there's other words that they use. However, one thing about paranormal is that as our science progresses, we have the ability to, uh, there's number one, <laughs> number one, we have the ability to create technology that is able to scan, able to detect the kind of things that the paranormal has said has been occurring. So, who knows, in the future, we might actually have better technology in order to see whether the paranormal truly is paranormal or whether it should become some sort of science on some certain cases like cryptids or aliens. Don't get me started on aliens, but we'll cover that in another topic. So, that is what's happening within a couple of weeks. And I just want to make sure that everybody knew yesterday, which was Sunday, I went ahead and, um, two, two, I went ahead and, uh, recorded a nice, uh, cryptic compilation. I'm in the process of getting more information and more stories on cryptids and aliens and everything so I can actually narrate the stories. However, if you happen to have some true or fictional stories that you would like read on this channel, narrated by me, please go ahead and send them to BigSkyMysteries at gmail.com. The information is in the description below. So, I think that's actually about it, and I think I wanted to keep this kind of short so that one, it could be all in one take, and two, I could make sure I don't hit that five nasty word um, limit. So I wanted to thank you all very much again for subscribing. Thank you much for uh, for clicking on this video. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. And also check out my other videos, which are going to be at the end. And I think that there's cards up there or something like that. I got to figure out where to point on some of this stuff learning curve. So, thank you all very much for your patience. Thank you for your patronage. And thank you very much. And it's only 16 days until Halloween. So, get ready. Well, some of you people have probably been celebrating the wonderful month of October all month and maybe a little bit, well, maybe even all year. Who knows? However, it's only that long until 16 days until Halloween. So, I'm very excited. And again, thank you all so much. Have a great evening. Keep it creepy. Good night.